Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Funto. I'm a Nigerian living in Moscow, Russia. If this is your first step on my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for coming back. Thank you so much for sticking around. And so this video is just going to be like a vlog. It is actually a vlog. This is not like a sit-down video. I don't know if it's gonna be out. But this video is just tell you guys that I'm moving. I'm moving. I'm moving to the dormitory. I've I, I, like I stopped. I used to stay in the student housing center till June this year, but then I moved out of the student housing center for one or two reasons, and then I started staying with my friend, Faith, and I'm moving out. I'm going to the dormitory. Faith has been such an amazing person. Faith literally upset me. July, August. July, August. And it's like the first week of September. So she's literally been like that blessing, to be honest. Yeah, it's time to say bye to Istra. And I'm my life. This is going to be like a vlog, to be honest, like I said earlier. You guys will join me to pack my things, arrange my things. Today is Monday. I need to go to Envedia office tomorrow, Tuesday. So I probably would move on Wednesday or Thursday. Because on the date on my on my letter says I need to move from 5th of September. Within 5th of September to 9th of September. Which means tomorrow, Tuesday. Till through till Saturday. Like that's like the time I have to move to the dormitory. You guys are join me to park, right? I don't know where to start from because my things are just everywhere. I need to also wash some of my clothes, like the last set of clothes that I've used. The last set of clothes that I've used in like one week this past week. And then I got some stuff because I need to get some food. Because summer is ending already. And I just had to buy a lot of things that would be expensive once in the winter. And I need to pack those things, I need to pack my clothes, I need to pack my shoes. And I need to do a lot of packing in church. Hey guys, good morning. This is today's Tuesday, and I'm literally, I did I ended up not packing yesterday. So I'm gonna be packing today, literally. But I need to, I have a prayer meeting. My pastor, um, minutes, yeah, after that, I'm gonna start arranging my things because I'm moving tomorrow. I need to pack all my stuff. I want to do laundry too. I'm going to load the washing machine now and uh, then arrange all my things in a well organized manner. I don't have, to, I don't have a lot of loads I'm packing that the taxi will be able to take all my load. I don't want to take. I don't want to order a truck, right? I think it's literally almost the same amount of money. But I don't want to order a truck because it's going to look so much in my face and I'm so tired to pack those things. So, not tired, but I'm just, I don't know. I just want to put all my things in like a particular, in a well arranged manner so that I can move my stuff. I don't, I'm trying to see. I bought two pots. I bought a pot and a wok. wok. I don't know what that can be. I plan to I plan to cook more to be honest this time. And I, I used to have just one pot, so I and it's a very small pot, so I decided to buy another smaller pot. Not so small, but like a another pot and a wok. And um I'm looking for that. I'm looking for a chair, but either ways I also have I have a lot of things to pack. Shall I'll carry guys along? See you guys later. Bye. Guys I'm trying to make breakfast. I'm making dumplings this morning. And that's literally what I'm eating. I'm eating dumplings. So my, my uh, I literally just woke up. I'm not even gonna lie. I had to wear these clothes, this particular top, because I need to close my skin, my body. I woke up pretty late today. Then I had short words of prayer, and then I had a prayer with Pastor, my Pastor. And I'm making breakfast. Once this dumpling is done, I'll go back to the room to continue what I was doing. By the way, I'd already loaded the washing machine and it, my clothes are washing already. Let me go and check what's up. Yeah, I have a lot of journals. This is my prayer journal. I'm going to show you guys maybe like the first two pages of this journal. So this is the first page. Letter from God. 
And it says you are the center of my heart. I love and think so much of you. Be honest, I don't think God literally thinks so much of us. I'm I'm in a certain phase in my life right now where I'm literally holding on to God more than ever before. It's not like but I think I will share this story someday, but not now. But you should hold me accountable that I need to give you a story of this time. This is also a birthday gift I got. And this, I love it so much. I'm literally going to say for a fact that. No, I'm not going to tell that But yeah, this, I love this gift so much. I'm going to tell that say, yeah, we wasn't going to get more. This is a breast birthday gift I got this year. And I'm not showing you guys what I eat here. I'm not showing you guys, but yeah, I love it so much. It's and, and the color, oh my god. White and rose gold. I'll come back when I bring out everything from the wardrobe. Guys, I got this work. I'm going to tell you guys something. When I got this work, it was given big size on the website. So what I got. It's very small. But I mean, I actually don't mind. If I'm being honest, I actually don't mind. Because, of course, I don't need something big, but I just feel like, why do you guys see me? Yeah. I think I have literally brought out all my things from the wardrobe in the room here. Let's go to the kitchen to pack my things in the kitchen. So this water filter is mine. Right, guys. This blender is mine. the other part of this blender but when I was moving to this apartment with face I don't know I think the blade got missing I don't know if I should trash the cup or check online if I can find a blade I don't know I, hope I buy a new blender I'm not trashing this guys I'm literally done packing my things from the kitchen and I've spread the clothes I was washing that I loaded this morning in the washing machine and I'm watching the second batch just like three pieces of clothes actually because they are white trying to wash them separately and now I just need to sort out this room arrange my clothes arrange the bags and bags that can enter each other I need to put them fix them into each other and then I'll put the day hey guys so I'm back it's I think it's almost next day and I'm going to try to get Actually, funny enough, I'm not even done. I'm almost done. Let me show you guys what I've done so far. I know you told your friend you're not okay. Tell me what's wrong and why you To a very large extent, I've sorted out all my things. So I need to tidy up the room. The clothes I washed earlier are almost dried. Once they are dried up, the, the native is going to go inside this black bag. Let me show you guys. The native is going to go into this black bag because that's where my natives are. Because my grandma sent them. This is what the room is looking like. Right? Let me show you guys what the room is looking like right now. This is what the room is looking like right now. I think I'm going to wash those ones. And pretty much it. 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 And that's. Uh, what yeah, that's literally all that is left for me to do and tidy up. And we'll see tomorrow when I move to the dormitory. Hey guys, this I'm literally done packing and like looking at my stuff now. This I lot to be honest, and I've swept. I've cleaned also, and I still have some clothes on the anger, and there's a bite shot. I think I need to literally close this video now, but today I'm literally done packing. 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 I'm literally I literally forgot what I was doing today. I just remember and I'm like, oh, I've, no, so I had to go and pack my stuff from the fridge. That, that's pepper, 
that's green pepper that's this spinach dried fish that my grandmom sent pepper beans that, that's blended pepper there beans what else is here some pepper that i bought from the african market to do ayamashi and what is it then my remaining tomato yeah i think pretty much that's all i need to i think i finished packing my things from the fridge guys so i'm done packing not done maybe like 85 85.6 percent packing and i've had my bath i think literally i'm done i've taken all, the, all the, my stuff downstairs and i think i just have to take the last set downstairs let me show you guys what it's left these are the only things that are left i have two of my winter jackets in this box then the many boxes and my shoes this yeah i think so many boxes are my shoes and my cord and work work whatever that thing is called yeah pretty much done uh, I literally forgot to show see still in back. <laughs> oh my god. Faith asking me if all my things entered a, car, a taxi. It did actually and I'm not surprised. But you know, on my way to the dormitory. I'll see you guys when I get there, I hope. But taking my taxi and to this to this to this guys. Just about the writing that I think I would do like a sit down story time on how this whole process of moving back to the dormitory was for me it was a whole lot of things happened and i'm super grateful for people that literally prayed with me and prayed for me the likes of pastor Ben and for david faith it was it was a whole roller coaster to be honest but yeah i'm moving to the hostel i want to take picture at that place but i'm gonna take picture when i get to my hostel and I'm bringing my stuff inside now you can see the bed is very new you see it has a plastic thing on it and this is my space I'll do like a proper vlog <laughs> I'll do like a proper vlog of the top of the dormitory that's my roommate's space I think I'm closing out the video here for moving into the dormitory with me and I'm not sure if <laughs> I did justice to this vlog because it was just everywhere. But it's not forget to not forget to subscribe, not forget to turn on your post notification bell to get notified every time I post a new video. And please not forget to share my videos with your friend. Come on, I've been struggling to have 500 subscribers. You guys, please now. Anyways, bye guys, and see you in the next video. The next video will be a tour of my dormitory. Bye guys. Never really asked to be brought into this place. You wanna love?